the art community and the music community definitely make Lubbock unique. Um, the people are incredibly friendly and that's something that I've never seen anywhere else in the world and I love that I really feel we invest in each other here and I think that's so cool. Oh, but there is a new place. The shack is awesome. Oh my God, it's so good. We had ribs there yesterday for lunch and they like fell just completely disintegrated. They were so tender. It was amazing. Their jalapeno cheddar sausage is so good. So good. And um, the couple that owns it is awesome. We really like for ladies night, La Diosa. They have incredible food. Uh, they're like tapas and small plates and stuff. It's, they're awesome. Um, and they do pitchers of sangria, <laughs> which are really affordable and a little bit dangerous. We've also done chimneys for ladies night um, and their margaritas, which they're famous for. Um, but you gotta make that a short ladies night. <laughs> you can't spend too much time at chimneys <laughs> without getting in trouble. <laughs> So, but if you're going for happy hour, we like to get a plate of nachos and sit in the back in a booth and um, drink margaritas. <laughs> for clothes and things like that, there's a place by campus called Indigenous Imports and they have awesome clothes. Um, very kind of like, I don't know, worldly inspired. So a lot of really awesome patterns and prints and things made in other countries, which is always cool. Uh, chrome, of course, is every girl in their 20s dreams. <laughs> it's one of the only places that I've been able to find in Lubbock that has, um, that features brands that you can find only in Dallas and Austin and, you know, big cities. And so if you have a favorite pair of jeans, especially if you're not from here, um, definitely try Chrome. They're very fashion forward. Everything that they sell is sort of right now. It's the National Ranching Heritage Center, which is cool. And they have houses from all different, from ranches all over the country that they've moved and put on uh, their site, which is amazing. Um, so getting to walk through those and, you know, they have one from the Sixes Ranch, and which is awesome. Ranching is so rooted in our culture and who we are as West Texas. That's what this land has been historically used for. And um, I think it's just amazing to kind of see that. It feels like in real time, you know, you see those, those buildings and people lived in them and worked in them. And um, to do something as huge as move buildings for historical preservation is just, I love it. <laughs> I'm Taylor and I live, love, love it.